Hey there, I'm back in my kitchen where I spend so much of my time not eating, I feel like, but preparing food for my family and for me, of course. So after I shared with you my magical breakfast recipe, hopefully you enjoyed it as much as I do every day, I got a lot of questions from you guys asking what I eat for the rest of the day, and I promised I would share that. Um, so a few things off the top, I did cut a lot of stuff out of my diet. I don't really believe in deprivation because I think when you start getting those cravings, it's really hard um, to fight them sometimes and you have to give in. But for the most part, diets are a little bit painful, whichever way you slice it. If you wanna look at it as you're just starting a healthy eating plan and you're not dieting or you're really trying to restrict calories, any way you look at it, it's gonna be a little bit painful sometimes, but it's okay, that's the point, because it's gonna get you to where you need to be eventually. So I cut out a lot of bad foods, that was first and foremost. Um, also, I keep it very simple. So fair warning, there's not all these crazy recipes that I'm going to give you, because I really eat the same things every day, and I keep it simple, because it's easier for me. It helps me prepare my food, first of all, which is key, to have everything ready and in your fridge, but it also helps me just run my family and in my life so it works for me I don't know about you guys you can get creative with all of these ingredients if you want to but I just choose not to for the most part I mean sometimes I do okay so one thing I start with always is a ton of water I drink probably about six of these a day five to six and I don't drink anything else other than black coffee uh, no soda no juice I would really love to drink milk, but I try not to do that either. So I really stick to water. It keeps me hydrated, it helps me get through my workouts, and it doesn't add any of those nasty calories that come from the soft drinks. So lots of water, first and foremost. Lots of, you know what I'm gonna say here, right? Fresh fruits and vegetables. I cut these up and just eat them as a snack. Um, I love avocados, and these are super decadent with a little salt and pepper. I love these microwavable sweet potatoes. They make it super easy. You pop them in the microwave, they're ready, healthy carb. You know, the pepper's key. And then I roast vegetables or steam them in the oven. This doesn't look maybe all that appetizing to you through the screen, but this is um, roasted Brussels sprouts and broccoli with a little bit of olive oil, salt and pepper. And if you shave off the little leaves, um, the little leaves on the Brussels sprouts and really toast them up in the oven, they're so good and they give you a little bit of a crunch. So I do like that. That's one recipe I'll give you. Okay. Lots of lean protein, and I use, um, you can sort of see this, uh, we grill probably um, three or four of these on Sunday, three or four of the lean hamburger patties, some turkey burgers, um, taco meat, which is basically ground turkey, any of that that I can combine into my meals. So this is key, having that protein like ready to go. And then um, I love fruits so much. I eat bananas, I eat oranges, I eat strawberries, um, blueberries, apples, any kind of fruit I love. And I showed you my magical oatmeal, which is just the oats, the peanut butter. And another key with the dark chocolate chips is that these double as a quick fix if you are craving something sweet. Pop like five of these in your mouth, you're good to go. It hopefully will curb your cravings. So that's pretty much what I eat. The lean protein, the fresh fruits and vegetables, the healthy carbs, the salted almonds when I um, snack, mix that with a fruit or vegetable. I try to always pair a protein with the fruit or vegetable and I drink a ton of water. So hopefully that's helpful. Good luck to you. If you have any questions, email me. And if you like my channel, subscribe and share with your friends. Thanks, have a great day.